A polypeptide is a singular linear chain of amino acids which are linked covalently by peptide bonds. These polypeptide chains go on to make proteins essential for growth, repair, structure function and the regulation of body's tissues. Protein synthesis starts in the nucleus of the cell, the location of DNA and site of transcription. Polypeptide synthesis begins when an, an enzyme of RNA polymerase unwinds and unzips a portion of the two strands of DNA. These strands of DNA has a start and stop signal, which are used in order to recognize the code needed for a particular protein. The complementary RNA nucleotides pair with the chosen DNA strands, U to A and G to C, instead of A to T. The RNA polymerase enzyme then binds these RNA nucleotides together, making a new single-stranded RNA. This new strand is called messenger RNA, or mRNA. This provides specific codes and information of the exact order of amino acids that needed to be bonded together to form a polypeptide. Once formed, the mRNA then travels in from the cell's nucleus through the nuclear membrane and into the cytoplasm, where it will attach to a ribosome. Once in the ribosome, this is where translation will take place. In the cytoplasm, there are many tRNA molecules available, also known as transfer RNA, that carry an amino acid, the monomer of a polypeptide. The ribosome within the cytoplasm reads the mRNA code three bases at a time, called codons. Then as the complementary anticodon found at one end of the tRNA. These codons provide the information that determine the corresponding amino acid at the other end of the tRNA, which carries that related amino acid. With the first tRNA, an amino acid is attached, then the next tRNA carrying another amino acid will move in and attach its anticodon to the mRNA's complementary codon. The two amino acids carried by the tRNA will link together, forming a peptide bond. Then the first tRNA and its anticodon will detach, leaving behind the amino acid where it will be recycled. The mRNA will shift through the ribosome so the next tRNA molecule can come in. The amino acid chain becomes longer until a stop codon is reached. Once the stop codon is read, the amino acid chain detaches and a polypeptide is formed. Errors in polypeptide synthesis. A change or mutation in the code of DNA will cause changes in the mRNA, which may be a single letter and may not cause the wrong amino acid to be coded, or it can code for an entirely different amino acid. This change in the polypeptide chain will cause the protein to be misshapen or not function as intended. This can lead to cell death, tissue damage, or nasty genetic diseases. Some genetic diseases caused by errors in protein synthesis are sickle cell anemia, cystic fibrosis, speculated by scientists, Alzheimer's disease.